Hey there, Nancy Drew Clue Crew. Michael and Phoenix here playing Nancy Drew, the Deadly Device. This is a binary puzzle. So, I mean, you press buttons and it makes some things appear and some things not appear. Disappear? Yeah, yeah, that's, that's the word I'm looking for. Mm-hmm. Maybe... We have to get certain numbers unlocked. Like maybe we don't need all of them unlocked. Oh, that would be a good thing. Is this something you know ahead of time, and you're trying to help me out here? No, no, I, they've changed the rules. So you know, last time I did it, they changed it a little bit because they're like, "Do you know what you're doing in this puzzle?" And I was like, "No, I'm just like That's clicking on things." Okay, well, trying to get out the password color. for the computers here. I need a hint. Look around the office for a clue. Okay. Oh, all the little letter things. Can't leave the card behind. Yeah. yeah, I know you can't leave the card behind, Nancy. Huh. So what did you say? The letter things? Does that? I mean, even though we're talking about binary, but... It's a uh, 0 through 15 binary, and they've got the chain here. But yeah, uh, write oh, down the letter unlock things. All binaries. So the letters are V... D. Are you I don't ready think this? the letters have anything to do with the binary. That's I think that's a different yeah. puzzle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because on the board it just said unlock all binaries, so you just got to unlock all of them. Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> We're totally good at this then. <laughs> Let's see what yeah. what did Hint say? Yeah. Huh? Look around his office, outside of his office, for something that shows binary numbers. Okay. Oh. So yeah, if we find something else that it might actually help explain what a binary number is, let's just try getting all of them. <laughs> Binaries are basically ones and zeros. Okay, so if it's all blue, that's 15, and it looks like 15 was like blue, 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 blue. Get out of there! Oh, hey, oh. Gray. How's it going? Bummer. We got a game over sequence for taking way too long. That's, yeah. How long have we been in this? Uh oh. At Can least 10 carry minutes. Carry over from the last video? <laughs> I hope not. Okay, well, at least hopefully the next time we do this, we won't have to do the puzzle with turning on the computer again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, can I shut this off? No, apparently not. And let's look in Nico's room, um, just in case there's anything extra interesting in the file. Actually, hold on. Haven't done that. Check. Can't check that off. That's done. Did that. Can't check that off I yet. Did a lot of things. Did that. That's done. Haven't done that. Check. Okay. Haven't done yeah. that. Still have to. Oh. Can't check that. Can't check. Can't check. Check. Haven't done that. Can't check that off okay, yet. Okay, so finally I think we've got our list down to things. We need to investigate Ryan a bit more. See the security video, but we can't turn on the computer, so I guess that's not it. Um, Snoop and Ellie's, Snoop Haven't and Mason's. Done that. Well, I tried to Snoop and Mason's, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe you didn't see everything. Maybe you're supposed to find something. Yeah, yeah, we were supposed to... Uh, yeah, oh. let's try that again then. All we did was play on his computer, I think. We, I don't think, maybe we didn't play on everything on his computer. We played on his computer and messed around with all his things. <laughs> yeah, this doesn't count as snooping. <laughs> maybe, maybe there's like something hidden inside his waste paper basket that we missed. Oh yeah, that, that could be it. Nope. <laughs> um, there goes that theory. Aha, here we go. This is what we missed. Biometrics. Ooh, here we go. Oh no, we have to make like fake fingers or something? Yeah. <laughs> I've done this in a game before. Yeah, gelatin, that's right. <laughs> Somebody made a gelatin mold of a finger. I'd like to try that in real life. I wonder how well it works. Okay. Can't do anything with that yet. Maybe that was all we had to do. 
Did that? Did you know? Yep, that was it. Yep. I haven't done that. What about Ellie's? Okay, so I just need to look out for the perfect time to snoop in Ellie's area. Perhaps if we talk Hello. to her. No. I'll let you go. Uh. Bye. I can't snoop in anything there while she's still around. Let's try calling our friends for help. Oh yeah, we almost forgot about them. Are they awake? Well, they're okay. gonna be awake now, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. Hi. Hey Hardy boys, how's it going? Uh -huh. I met Mason. What's Mason like? Cold and detached. That's a reassuring pair of personality traits. He sounds a little textbook. See if you can get a reaction out of him somehow. Oh, I think we will when he finds out we messed with all his stuff. <laughs> Maybe that's what we're supposed to do. Maybe that was a puzzle. I met the whole crew. Now the work begins. There are some intelligence guys here who owe us a favor. We'll see if anyone's got a pass they're hiding. Hmm, interesting. Mason and Ellie seem to hate each other. On a scale of one to standoff? They're on opposite shifts to avoid one another. Interesting. That might come in handy. I met Ryan. So, what's his story? Her. Okay, hang on. Adjusting mental image, removing mustache, change haircut and shoes, done. Wait, adding hat. Okay, done for real. So what's her story? She's the one who made the part that malfunctioned and killed Nico. That's serious. But if she wasn't arrested, there must be some doubt. Some, but Victor really thinks she might be the one. Does she seem like a cold-blooded killer? What do you think, Phoenix? Well, she almost killed us as we walked into the room. Okay, so <laughs> Phoenix is going with yes. <laughs> Ryan's the saying. killer and uh, Gray is the teddy bear. Yes. <laughs> well, yeah, that's that something. Although the nice ones, they can be big trouble. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. See ya. Aww. Let's just stay on her good side for now. Okay. Let's call Victor. Looks like a cheery fellow. Victor here. Victor here. Har, har, har. I'm Victor. Mason says Nico was stealing from him. Is this true? No, because the work isn't Mason's to begin with. It's a little troubling that he views it that way. Hmm. What do you think of Mason? Smart kid. Don't know much about him. You seem pretty sure Ryan's the one who killed Nico. That's because she did. She made the part that malfunctioned and killed Nico. And confidentially, the police told me they're almost certain it's her. They just mm. don't have enough evidence to get a conviction. This is your case. But don't let Ryan's buddy act fool you. She's not who she seems. Oh. I better get going. Bye. Wow, poor, poor Ryan. Uh, I hope she knows her boss hates her. <laughs> yeah. She seems okay. What's up? Okay, Deirdre. You read up on the case, right? I don't understand why Ryan was under so much scrutiny, but never sent to trial. From what I gathered, something didn't add up with the video and the timeline. Someone had to be in the lab with Nico. Otherwise, he'd still be here today. So, if her alibi stands up, it couldn't be her. Exactly. Unless there's something big I'm missing. Something's weird about this whole thing. Well, don't keep me in suspense. Figure this out. I asked her about the night of the murder. She was pretty much mute. I'm undercover here. I can't push too hard. Can you see what you can find on your end? I'll see what I can find. All I've got is the database. Don't expect any miracles. All I've got is a criminal database. I can't really do much here, Nancy. I'm sorry. Yeah. Wasn't she supposed to text us something like the the video number? Uh, she was. I thought I was supposed to text, but so far it's just Ned, which is totally fine. I'm actually really loving the text messages. Yeah, the text messages I think are a bonus because uh, we're playing the bonus edition. Oh, well, that's so worth it to get text messages from Ned every few minutes in the game. I expect this is the best. Yeah, and I think also the games are also a bonus as well in the, the bonus edition, which you get by pre ordering. So mm. if you're watching this video now, I guess you can't pre order and get the bonus edition. Sorry. 
now I'm gonna talk to Mason. Okay. See if he really does oh, freak I... out because <gasps> footsteps. Who's there? Oh dear. Uh oh. Hello? Don't answer it. Oh dear. Who was that? Sounded like an angry trick or treater. <laughs> Without saying trick or treat. Well, yeah. Wait a minute. Did anything happen? Person no. Just walked up and just came, banged on the door, and then left. Okay. Suspicious. Someone's looking for Nancy. Maybe, maybe it's Mason. Maybe. He knew you messed with all the stuff on his desk. Oh, it's got to be Mason. Yeah. Or maybe he was <laughs> just really, really lost. Go find them. Alright, so let me see. What are you doing? I can't sneak into Ellie's place yet. Let's talk to Mason. Hey. Who do you see on an average day? Just me. Sometimes Ryan. You ask a lot of questions. Ever thought of being a scientist? Mm, sometimes. Good answer. The world needs more people with questions. And fewer people who are sure they have the answers. Yeah. Wait, what? I'm so confused now. Uh, let's talk about him being upset. Or actually, first, <laughs> uh, uh, Phoenix, who, who is this voice? Uh, okay, fun fact. The voice of Mace. I hope I'm allowed to say this, otherwise, you know, but it's totally fine. Um, the voice of Mason, if you've played Shadow at Water's Edge, it is the same voice as Rentaro, who built the mechanical cat for his girlfriend and works in a tool shed and everything, which is pretty crazy because it doesn't sound anything like him. But I liked Rentaro a lot in that game, and apparently it's definitely the same guy. And Rentaro is a lot nicer, but now it's like he's upped his anger a little bit. <laughs> Well, either way, he's he's good at science and tools and things like that. So let's say he's, uh, yeah. let's say he's a mechanical engineer. That, let's say that's the kind of scientist he is. Okay, all right. That's like one of the three kinds of engineering I know about. There's You can you can be a mechanical engineer, a biochemical engineer, or you can drive a train. Do you, Do you like Ryan? Engineer? Let me save you some time. I don't like anyone. That can't be true. Yeah, it can't be. Observe, and I'll demonstrate. But, oh, oh, oh! He gave me a thumbs down! Other people. Oh, oh, not cool. Not cool, <laughs> not cool, bro. See, if it was me, I was going to say, but what about your mother? You have to like your mother, right? <laughs> right. But okay. no, no, he just went straight for the thumbs down. Mm. You look a little upset. Someone moved my things. Someone will pay. Jeez. <laughs> and then he smiles. Okay, so that's what happens if you mess around with his pens. I'll let you go. <laughs> See you later. I, I was kind of hoping it would allow us to snoop into Ellie's area, but apparently that's not the case. What are you doing? Yeah. But someone will pay. Someone moved my post-it note. Someone. <laughs> will pay. <laughs>